this isn't really going to be your last show, is it? Every show's your last show. That's my philosophy. Thank you, Plato. It was curtains, and everybody knew it. That's where a Prairie Home Companion begins with the final broadcast of a beloved radio program. It's home. The Fitzgerald Theater has been condemned to the wrecking ball. GK is the host, played by Garrison Keillor, who knows a lot about keeping his show from the heartland alive on the airwaves. Yes, one little thing can revive a gun, and that is a piece of the rhubarb pie. Serve it up nice and hot, maybe things are as bad as you got. Meryl Streep and Lily Tomlin are just wonderful as Yolanda and Rhonda Johnson, the surviving members of a singing act known on the county fair circuit. Changing our petticoats in the ladies' toilet and the boys trying to peek in. That was the only good part about it. Yolanda has some personal history with GK and can't understand why he's so composed right. on this emotional occasion. And you know, that's why I think that our romance was so short. Because I knew that when we broke up, you would not cry, so I got way over it. Yolanda finally gets her daughter Lola a moment in the spotlight. She's played by Lindsay Lohan, giving her own rendition of Frankie and Johnny. She shot the bastard in the heart and ruined his Can you imagine is the dangerous woman, a mysterious angelic figure floating through the finale? Show's almost over. And more ways than one. Nice perfume. Tommy Lee Jones is Axe Man, is waiting for the ensemble to take their final bows. He symbolizes investors who will demolish the theater and all of its traditions. Robert Altman is the perfect director for this film, letting us eavesdrop on the most bizarre, witty, and fascinating behind the scenes chit chat. We come from people who brought us up to believe that life is a struggle, and if you should ever feel really happy, be patient, this will pass. This movie is both robust and tender from start to finish. It's a glorious tribute to memories that give our lives joy and spirit. The film expresses appreciation for things past without insisting on more. I love this movie. It's one of Robert Altman's best, and one of the best movies of the year so far. I give A Prairie Home Companion four stars, I'm Roger Ebert, ABC 7 News. In the sweet